Now, one of those Senate seats up for election is right here in Indiana. It is the top race on the ballot for every voter in our state. And it's an important choice. The winner will be in office for six years. That's through the next president's term. So 13 News wants to help you get to know the candidates. Democrat Tom McDermott, current Senator Republican Todd Young, and Libertarian James Senek. We heard from Young and Senek tonight at 5 and 6. Tonight, Emily Longnecker talks with McDermott. His campaign slogan is just four words, right under his picture on the McDermott for Senate website. All Hoosier, no You could say that on TV? No, we can't. Not really. But even if we have to bleep part of it, Tom McDermott, Indiana's Democratic candidate for the United States Senate, is just fine with voters knowing he's comfortable saying it. Because the way McDermott sees it, it's the truth. No bull is what you get with me. It's the reason McDermott believes he's the longest serving mayor of Hammond, 19 years. Part of the reason my, my residents keep voting for me is I, I never sugarcoat what's going on. I tell them honestly what's going on. So 13 News sat down to ask him some questions ahead of November 8th. Why are you running for the United States Senate? I'm patriotic. I'm afraid for democracy. I'm afraid for our country. I believe in simpler times when somebody lost an election, they would call up the other side and wish that person well. And, and even though they may not mean it, it's just what you're supposed to do. And I've been in that position before myself, but I've never seen our country as divided as, as it is today. If you are elected, what would be your top priorities when you get to Washington? I think November 8th is going to be a referendum on Roe versus Wade's overturning. And that's one thing I promise Hoosier women is when I get to Washington, D.C., I'm, I'm going to know why I got there and I'm going to know what my marching orders are. And I'll always fight to protect the rights of Hoosier women to make their own personal health care decisions. McDermott's campaign ads address the top issues he says he wants to tackle in Washington. McDermott also supports legalizing marijuana for medicinal and recreational use. He even smoked a joint in a campaign ad. We should be making money off of cannabis, uh, jobs, economic development, you know, state of Illinois made more tax revenue off of cannabis last year than they did off alcohol. And we're a business state. We could do better. These past few months, the only road trips McDermott's been taking have been around Indiana campaigning. I've driven 70,000 miles across this state. National pundits have said Indiana's Senate race is not a competitive one. Even so, McDermott doesn't speak about if he goes to Washington, but when. McDermott says that he's especially proud of the financial growth and stability he's developed in Hammond. You can hear much more of Emily's conversation with all three candidates. We've posted extended interviews with all three tomorrow on WTHR.com elections, and we're streaming them on WTHR+.